Hello everyone, uh, my name is Rob White, White Robert, uh, <laughs> on the internet, um, and I'm here to bring you a little let's play of... Commander to the research uh, labs. Shush. Commander to the research Thank labs. Thank you. Of uh, XCOM, Enemy Unknown. Um, it's uh, a fun alien shooting game, and uh, we're going to run through it. I've done the first uh, mission, which didn't go so well, because some of my dudes got shot, but... You know, skipped all that junk and got to the, the bit that I like, which is uh, customising my characters. Uh, so we have our our list of uh, of dudes here, all people that I know. So uh, hopefully they'll enjoy getting shot at by aliens uh, in my game. Um, Commander so to the research yeah, we'll see how we go. Commander to the research um, labs. Yes. So let's ah, do it. Commander. This. I was wondering when you'd be stopping by. Welcome to engineering. Anything they can dream up in the research labs, we can build it here. Speaking of which, Dr. Valen has just sent us some new schematics. With your approval, we will begin fabrication. Alrighty. Uh, okay, so the idea is that you need to build up your resources and We've still got some room to grow uh, up here. manage your really facilities in order to help fight the alien threat. To so to what we'll do is stick a power generator in, in here. Unfortunately, the deeper we go, the more start the digging this out, but more build it is on their way to begin construction. I'll send stuff. word when the new facility is operational. Yeah. Videos are boring. Uh, Right, and let's start research into weapon frames. mission control. Seems the complexities of our latest research projects are overwhelming the current staff. I hope you'll consider... Shush. We will get more scientists. Right, so from the globe, we will find some adventure. Let's do this. Commander, Alien we picked up multiple requests for assistance. Abductions in progress are marked on the hollow globe. Alrighty, so we can only go to one of these. Um, so, do we want two hundred dollars, simoleons, I guess, uh, engineers or scientists? Let's get some scientists. Alrighty, who are we gonna take? Let's let's take some of the girls. Let's take that unit. Let's let's take Mrs. White and Ms. Van der Elsen. And let's see if I can knock out a successful mission. Prepare for deployment, right. strike one. Let's do this. <clears throat> Listen up. We're going to be dropping you deep in the Nigerian interior for the next operation. We've picked up a local broadcast indicating alien activity within a major metropolitan area. We should get down there and eliminate any hostiles. Let's do this. Eliminate the hostiles. Central, this is Big Sky. The strike team is touching down now. Standing by for your orders. Roger, Big Sky. Reading you five by five. Strike one has the green light for deployment. Alrighty. So, this is Joe. And every time I play XCOM, I always have Joe, because he's lovely. And for some reason he always ends up as a sniper. I don't know if that's his innate cowardliness and hiding away from the uh, the enemy he's anything to testify, but uh, I don't know. So yeah, he's a sniper, so we're going to stick him here. And let's see what he can see. Um, right. Next up, James, aka Captain Dunbar, uh, one of my regular D&D &D, uh, players. Um, I think he'll respect the run and gun style that I'm about to put him into by having him rush up to this door. Hopefully he won't get shot. No aliens yet. Alrighty. DVD. D. Van der Elsen. A uh, dear friend from uni. Uh, Let's hope hopefully she won't get shot, because Joe might be sad. Right, moving on up. And of course, Mrs. White, aka my wife. So let's not get her shot. That's the goal. <laughs> 
but we have aliens to fight, so I'm sure she'll use all her moxie to... Uh... Oh, they're behind us. Interesting. This could be problematic. Oh dear. Right. Get him, Joe. Get him. Right, uh, I need to get to cover, because otherwise we have the crack kicked out. Uh, can we go there? Can't go there. We can go there, though. Let's go there. Enemy in oh, sight. shit. Oh, more baddies. Okay, right. Uh, somewhat exposed here. Uh, Let's just take cover over here. Right. Get on, James. I'll put you in harm's way, it's fine. Get him. Oh. Come on, James. Right, D, I want you in there flanking those other dudes. Get in there. Uh, let's overwatch you in case more aliens come along. So when overwatching, if any aliens run into a line of sight, you can shoot them. They're backing up. Advance. No, they are retreating. No, he's not retreating. Incoming he's shooting. Fire. That's definitely not retreating. Okay. What next? Come on. There we go. Right, nothing. Nothing else. Right, Joe, I need you to... Can you pick up on a roof? Not yet. No. Uh, right. Um... It's going to be more... F There's only one dude left over there, so I'll let James deal with him. Let's move into this room a little bit more. Uh, uh, hunker down. Just in case. Alrighty. Go, go, gadget wife. Um, can we get this dude? I'll leave him for James. Get in there. Got something over here. Ah! Whoa, lose me. Okay, so they're all on that side. What's our odds? 40%. Uh, let's go. But if I hit the car, maybe it looks better. Oh no, I did hit. Excellent. Good shooting wife. Uh, right. James, I want you to kill that alien. Where is he? He's there, right. If I don't hit him... No. Oh. Okay, I'm going to hit this dude. Oh, let's get this dude. <coughs> yes. Negative damage. Right, D, not much use over there, so let's double time it over there, please. Here we go. Okay, so they're powering up. So this one gets a little bit extra health from his mate. But if I shoot his mate, then they'll both die. So generally, when that happens, I want to try and shoot the sword person. Oh, James! Oh, crap. He's taken a hit. That's no good. Ow! Ow, dear. I really... Uh, yeah, my wife will kill me if I kill her. Uh, right. Go, Joe. Get you into a useful position, for goodness sake. Run, run! Right. Yes. Oh, grenades. Whoa! Wobbly. Right, uh, let's do... A little bit of explodifying here, because we're taking a lot of damage. So. Oh, can we not get that? Oh, Jesus. Try and throw a grenade. Just hoik it. There we go. That might get it. 
I hit nobody. That was rubbish. There is no longer an alien here. Right, okay, so... No, you can see one. <coughs> Get him! Nope! Another miss. Negative damage. Right, can D do any better? Oh, overwatch. Incoming over here. Oh, oh, there was a wall there. Oh, now there is. Right, what have we got? 65, 62, and 49. Right, let's get number one. Although, look at all those cars, that car's about to explode. It might kill them anyway. Ah, oh, bad right, this issue. Casey Mills. Yes, a hit. Good hit. What well a D. Yeah, I'm gonna have to see if I can get James to come around. Get inside this. Oh yeah, stay there. Please stay there while the car explodes. Oh. I knew it was still on there. Alright, yeah, James will have it. Or not. Oh dear. James is critically wounded. And I don't think I have any med kits. <laughs> Sorry, James. <laughs> You're doomed. And D also appears to be doomed. Oh dear, I'm not very good at this game, am I? Commander, you may want to instruct your men to exercise restraint when using explosives. While certainly effective at killing aliens, they also destroy the artifacts we're hoping to recover from the bodies. Just something to consider. Yes, well, that's all well and good, but my dudes are getting shot to shit, so, uh, we won't be following that advice at the moment. Um, right, um, right. We're in trouble. Come on, Joe. Negative damage. Oh, go, go, gadget wife. This. Oh, shit. Okay, we're in a, we're in a sticky situation here, but... Uh, things should be okay. Right, here he comes. Is he going to shoot? No, he's going to double move. Which is good for us. He's going to shoot. I expect. Yes, he is. Not the wife! Oh, 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 oh. Okay, I think... If we can kill this, these dudes before James bleeds out, we might have a chance of saving him, so... Get him, Joe! When in doubt, deploy Joe. Right. Time to do something... stupid. Whoop. Do not fuck regret. with my wife. And we saved James, so hooray! Excellent. Right, now we slap him into recuperation for the next ten years and I'm sure he'll be fine. So, not bad for a first time out. Let's see if anybody got promoted. Oh, we have promotions. Commander to the situation room. Commander to the situation room. Situation in the situation room. Alrighty, so. Joe being a sniper, he can take a snapshot, removes the sniper's restrictions for firing and overwatch after moving. Any shots suffer a minus 20 aim penalty, but the more important one is this one, which we're going to take, which is squad sight. So it allows firing at targets in any allies' sight radius. So he can be like miles away from an enemy, but so long as one of our allies can see him, he can get that shot off. So that's really cool for snipers. And 
The heavy weapons specialist provides a crucial service to the squad. With the rocket launcher in tow, there are demolitions experts. Absolutely, right. Apparently, my wife is a badass, which is true. Uh, so she's going to be a heavy, so she's going to be packing rocket launchers and uh, other fun explosive things. So I'm sure she'll be looking at that. Alright, let's see. James, gravely wounded, as is D. Many days. Many, many days. But that's okay, because we have backup dudes. So, that's what we do. Uh, building a laboratory. Right. Oh. Council of Transmission. The XCOM squad deployed to the to successfully stop healing abduction. And they give us four. Scientists. We will be in touch, we'll Commander. In touch, Commander. Uh, Commander, uh, to the I realize our troops have to put their own survival first, but every alien we use explosives Shut against is up. one less opportunity to recover new yes, artifacts. Every member of the council is going to want right. satellite coverage, so we should plan our deployments carefully. Okay, we, I want to launch satellites in Russia, because that's getting up quite high. Uh, India as well. Um, Russia gives us expert knowledge and scientists. India gives us nothing but future combat um, and two engineers a month so that's a steady stream of stuff um, so I'm receiving you we'll monitor that contact but I don't think it's related to the UFO activity yeah. huh? no it's not it's to the people so I can explain what I'm doing and why um, right let's throw that up in Russia so we don't have to worry about Russia for a while so panic goes down if the panic reaches five, then the countries start pulling out, and then we run out of money, and then we're fucked. So, but we're not doing too bad at the moment. We've uh, got a steady income, and we've got a few credits. So, uh, let's pop over to engineering, and let's see the thing. Let's, let's buy a med kit. Um, and equip at least one of my characters with it. Um, because we're having Commander, our butt kicked. We've so suffered a number of casualties and haven't found suitable let's replacements yet. We need to start hiring additional yeah. soldiers through the barracks. Let's give it to Big Dave. Big Dave, you can have a med kit. Right. Uh, okay, let's scan for more activity. I think we've got time for another one. Satellite coverage completed, Russia. And we. Power Hooray! Right, let's build. If the digging is done. Digging is done. A, a laboratory. Uh, or not. Because we don't have any money. Because we bought a med pack. Right, okay. Jolly good. We bought a med pack and now we can't afford a lab. Jolly good. Well played there. Never mind. Right, moving on. <coughs> Moving on swiftly. Uh, here we go. Right. Alien UFOs. Uh, Raven 1. Right. Let's see if we can shoot down an alien spaceship. We probably can, because I think this is one of the story missions. Da -da -da -da. Here we go. We, we do have indeed eyes have eyes on the bandit. Or bandito, as I like to call it. Oh, kicking ass. Great job, Maverick. Central, this is Voodoo 37. We have a confirmed kill on Voodoo 37. I repeat, the UFO is down. I'll copy, over. Solid copy, Voodoo 37. Nice work. Central left. All right, people. Retest recon satellite Bravo and get me a visual on that crash site. She's coming into range yes. now, sir. On screen. Magnify. <gasps> Crashed alien spaceship. What could be within? Still in one piece. Commander, I recommend we get a strike team no to the crash site immediately. That's why we're sending the Sky Ranger. Right, who's on the team? Who's, who are we taking? Vince and Joe and Liz and Dave. Right, this should be good. This should be this. Next one 
once again, try not to get anyone killed. Strike one. Prepare for landing. Get in there. Our target site is near the German border. It looks like the aliens went down in a sparsely populated area. If there are civilians in the area, I hope they stay clear. All right, hang on, Germany. We're coming to help. Since we caused this massive alien spaceship crash, so we should probably do something about it. This is Big Sky. We're just okay. the crash site. Strike one is in position to engage. Loud and clear, Big Sky. We'll monitor those readings from here. Strike one is authorized to assault the alien craft. Okay, so. Because Joe has got that um, new ability, so he can see what my guys can see, it's generally a good idea to move everybody else first, so... Let's move the wife over there. And let's move... Pleasant Kenobi, as he is known to the internet, over here. And Big Dave in between. So we look cool. Right, I'm actually going to leave Joe there, because he's got high ground, so it should be... Although, maybe I should move over here. Yeah, let's move him over there. Aha! Hostile spotted. Aliens. So, presumably... Oh. Cover my Oh, Joe. God, it's like the Underdark all over again. Whoa. Right. Uh, right, okay, we'll leave Dave there to heal Joe. Uh, right, Vince, get in there. And kick some butt. More or less. No, nope. it didn't. Hit it a little bit more. Ooh, closer. Damn it. Enemy is yes, still alive. because you missed him. Take responsibility for accidents. Um, right. Oop. Can Dave do any better? Go, Big Dave. Yes. That's a hit. I probably should have moved Joe. Oh, but he's good very good. He's down. <laughs> Alrighty, come on, Mrs. White. Uh, what are we going? Alright, dude's all the way over there. Let's take it easy. See if we can get a shot. Right, now she's heavy, she's got a massive gun. See? A massively unaccurate gun. Thank They're God. Falling back. No. Oh, thanks. Oh, right, Joe, finish that dude off, will you? Be a dear. Ah, there's the alien spaceship. You see that? There? Uh -huh. Oh, damn it. I don't know if I'll get a shot from there, but it's a good position to move to, come around the side. Yep. Could hoik a grenade over the top, I suppose. Oop, steady. Steady. Ah, it always does this, I don't know why. It's like, either you can throw it two feet, or... Yes, that's how we do it. A little over the kill, overkill, but mm, we've got the job done. Right. Yep, there's the alien spaceship. So, what we're going to do, let's heal up Joe before we go. Uh, heal wound. Target Joe. 
Yeah, Joe, quit your bitching. Your bitching. Go there, and then we can run in and blow stuff up. Right. Okay, watch, please, Mr. Edmonds. Right. Better come around the side. Alien spaceship, look. Awesome. Okay. Uh, let's go here. And just keep a lookout, just wait while Dave catches up. Because one of the things that I like to have a tendency to do when I play this game is to just let people run off in random directions and then they're like 1v millions and they all they get shot. So teamwork is key. Let's leave Joe we'll do him last. Right. Vince, time to be brave. Get to that door if you wouldn't mind, please. Huh. Positive enemy contacts. We found death aliens. To withstand an impact like that, at such a velocity, the materials used in that vessel's hull must be at least an order of magnitude beyond any yep. element we know it's of. It's alien. One would say. Oh, hello. What the hell is that? It's an alien with a plasma rifle. Our readings can't be right. If they were, that's a being of almost pure energy. Right, let's see if Jake can shoot it. The answer is no. <laughs> right, let's see. I need some cover. Move to there, do you think? Not quite got a flank on him, but oh, 22 percent chance. Yeah, I like those odds. They were bad odds. I put Vince in a bit of a sticky situation here. Hopefully, he won't be too shot up because he's flanked. Oh dear, he could die here. Oh, yes, excellent. But now he's totally exposed by that energy alien, so, uh, yeah, that dude, so he's gonna be in trouble. He's dead. Vince is so dead. Or not. Cover the flanks. <laughs> Big Dave is dead. Critical. Nine damage. Look at that. Nine damage. It's absurd. Come on, Joe. Save the day. Camera angles. He's down. He's down. He's set no totally round. down. Critical hit as well. Good job. A little late since we've lost Dave already, but never mind. Right. So, need that be able to watch. Um, right, we need to get Vince into a sensible position. So let's move into the alien spaceship. That's a sensible position. Boom! No longer a threat. And there we go, done. Chalk up another, Chalk up another one. one. Well, sadly, Dave, you're dead. So, uh, when we come back, we'll see if we can uh, do better and not kill all my friends. Uh, so, until next time, I shall see you later.